Hello everyone, welcome back. Today I brought in this liquid amber tree to um, do a bit of pruning on it. <coughs> um, there's quite a few problems with this tree. One is this root here. It's obviously been growing in pots for a long time and just the roots are just wound around. And it has a bit of a root flare right now, but this old root, I think we're going to cut that back a bit. It also has this here, where the tree was obviously, I don't know, maybe when it was tied as a young tree or something, it left a bit of a lump in it here. That's not great. And then up here, there's a lot of big branches and stuff. Um, I've taken off a big one here, took a big one off back here, and then another one back here. And reduced it back a bit. Now, the other problem I have is there's nothing up here, as you can see. So, I'm going to try and maybe get this branch here, grow out and fill out this space. So, I'm not going to touch that branch. I'm going to reduce the top back a bit so that this one gets a bit more energy and we try and fill it out when it's in the leaf it looks fine because you can't see all this problems only this so yeah so we'll just get started on that I'll start pruning it back and we'll try and get it to into some bit of a shape ready for next year I want to put it back quite hard because it does grow quite rigorous. Vigorous, not rigorous, sorry. In the, uh, the summer, it does grow like crazy. So I'm just going to put it right back to one or two buds. And then I have this branch here. I think I'll just pull off completely off there. Yeah, maybe I'll move the camera in a bit closer now so you can see the top bit while I'm working on that. And then we'll do the bottom afterwards. Let's bring the camera closer. Okay, so a bit closer for you so you can see. Um, I'm just going to take you back, like I said, for a few buds. We'll try and get it, start getting a bit more ramification. Mm. One here, it's kind of going in a funny place. Let's put it off and open it up a little one coming off the tree here. Let's take that out. Mm. Back all together. I think I'll take that one off. A bit of a stub here I'll take off. That's just permanent. Take off. Let's clean this one up a bit. Throw a big one here. Take that back a bit more. We're cleaning up. Then one back here, I'll take off. Quick here. Not so good. Okay. Here, I think back. No, this front branch, as you can see, it's got branches growing in every direction. So, let's take this one back, right back there. Up there, get rid of that. Two kind of funny branches here. I'll take this one back, I'll take this one off altogether. This one growing in towards the tree, I'll take that off. That one there, I'll take it off. 
Here, but it's kind of facing the wrong way. Oh, I'm gonna take back to that book there. It's a bit long, right? No, I'll leave it for now. Up here, we can take it off. Take it off. Now. This branch, I'm just going to take the tip of this one. A bit off there. Off there. Just to try and. Off this one, just to try and get this to go back that way a bit. And move on to this side. We have one coming out the bottom here. Let me get rid of that one. There we take off. Um, she's got a bit of a bulge in here. So I think I'll take that one off completely. But uh, facing buds. I'll lay back as well. Take that back. Head branch there will take off. Yeah, it's got some buds back here. Here now, I might leave that one because again it's filling up this space. So let me just take it off there and off there, and that will fill in back here a bit. Okay, oh, what the fuck? No, that bit there will take off. Down on the side, one is kind of going right up into the apex. So get rid of that now. Looking at the apex now, what we need to side on big bulges here. I want to keep this branch though. I think I need to decide on which one of these I want to get rid of, or at least in my back because. Having two of them up there is not great. Mm. Oh, maybe it should all come on, but it's a tricky one. Here, everything's going to go in this direction. All these. I attempted to take off this whole thing, but then do all these only branches coming out this way. Just take it back a bit first and see. Take that off there. Yeah, I think I'm gonna take off this whole branch. Mm. Take the whole one off altogether. Mm. 
to this one. We it's a bit funny because there's been so many branches coming out the same spots. We've ended up with two bulges up there. So maybe I should take the two of them off completely. Try and get some more back pudding back here. It tends to put out well. Yeah. See what to do. Take it all back to here. Keeping this branch. Let's, let's take off this one first. And we'll work from there. Go right back to that branch in case it dies off. Just take it off here and then we'll throw it back. Branch takes. Hopefully, like I said, we'll get some back putting back here and we can take off all this. Try and get some lighter center branches going off. I think I'm going to take this one right back now. That. I think this one needs to come right back as well. Now. Okay, I might leave it at that for now. See how it goes. And make some more decisions next time. To do it a bit at a time. Now, the next thing is this camera down so we can see the button. The next problem is this thing here. So I'm thinking of. It's been annoying me for a couple of years now. I think it's time to get rid of it. So I'm just going to cut that off there. Dies off, dies back now. Better, I think when it dies back a bit, we'll kind of pair off the bed, the, the dead bit. Then we'll give a root here, take off, and then eventually try and get it molding better with the tree. Okay, so all we need to do now. Let's put a bit of cut paste on all that. What's up here? I think there's much I can do with this problem here. 
unless I decide one day to just start again and cut it back. Regrowing the tree, but no, I'm not ready to do that just yet with it. I would say like that been growing it inside a pot and when it's outgrown that pot it's just been put in a bigger pot and so on and so on and the roots are just wrapped round and round itself it does have some out bottom roots here growing out right but the ones are pretty bad okay i think we're gonna call that one done We'll come back to it and have a look how it's growing in the spring. Hopefully it'll recover well. This branch may need trim and prune right back again, but I think I've butted it enough for today. Okay, so we'll leave it at that. If you like the video, give me a thumbs up. If you have any comments, think, let me know. And we'll see you on the next one.